On the 7th of January 2025, a magnitude 7 earthquake shook southern Tibet. Let's spend a few minutes exploring its tectonic setting. The magnitude of the earthquake is estimated at 7 at a depth of around 11 kilometers and it's a normal fault just on the north side of the Himalayas. We know this from the USGS moment tensor which is constructed from recordings of the earthquake from seismometers around the world and has been followed by a whole series of aftershocks. What the moment tensor tells us is that the fault plane upon which the earthquake occurred trends north-south and is a normal fault which means that the crust here has been split apart, east-west extension. So let's step back and put this earthquake in its tectonic context on the southern margin of the Tibetan Plateau. The plateau, of course, is part of a whole series of mountain ranges in Central Asia. These mountains are formed by the collision between the Indian subcontinent and the rest of Asia, recorded by the opening of the Indian Ocean, which has allowed geologists to reconstruct the convergence history. India has been colliding with the rest of Asia for around 50 million years, and it's continuing at a rate of around 4.5 centimetres a year. Now we might expect, because of this continuing convergence, that the crust is being pushed together in the areas of southern Tibet. But actually it's more interesting than that. GPS readings show that the active motion across this area is doing this. The Tibetan plateau is being pushed northwards and squirted out to the east. And it's within this context that the earthquakes in Tibet are forming. And there are an awful lot of earthquakes. These are just the ones in the upper crust. So, as India collides northwards and Tibet is extruded sideways, let's now add the earthquake from January 2025. It occurred here with this type of motion, normal faulting, the crust stretching out as it's being squeezed out to the east. And it's not been alone. There's been a whole series of these normal fault earthquakes across the Tibetan plateau through time. So that's the context for the earthquake in southern Tibet in January 2025. The Tibetan plateau being extruded out sideways towards the east as India collides with Asia, remorselessly moving forward at around 4.5 centimetres a year. And we can expect this style of tectonics to continue.